Park Fest, we have a video marketing team that utilizes this studio. It's one of the largest in Fort Smith. Headshots, so when employees come in from out of town. Thanks, Kenzie. I'm too far away. <laughs> one of the things we do here in the studio are take employee headshots. So when we have employees in the field that come here and visit the corporate office, we can take their picture. Communication is an important part of the ArcFest culture. In fact, several of our leaders utilize our studio to film their quarterly reports. Isn't that cool, Laura? That's awesome, Lauren. And back to you, Caitlin. <laughs> Welcome to our truck stop. This is our large break room where employees can come and have lunch and take their breaks. We have lunch vendors that come in every day to service lunch. Once a quarter, we have a casual Q&A session with our CEO, Chairman, and President, Judy McReynolds. We have our awesome Starbucks coffee machine. And then we also have what we call the Fresh Market, where you purchase snacks and drinks to get you through the workday. One of our core values at Earth Best is wellness. This is our fitness center located at our corporate headquarters. In this room, we offer free fitness classes for our employees to take anytime they want. 'm a supervisor in customer solutions quotations uh, my team here gives out quotes for customers looking to move freight in different modes and services uh, basic communication skills basic computer skills but ultimately what's important is strategic and critical thinking as well as customer service and people skills So I have a bachelor's degree in business administration with a major in innovation and entrepreneurship. And fun fact, I was one of the first four people from UCA to graduate with that degree. What's up, Dr. Fisher? So I'm the project manager for operations and safety, and I manage the schedules of some executives' calendars, as well as organizing some large-scale meetings and events for the company. A lot of what our team focuses on is about employee growth and development and making sure that uh, we have a culture that allows employees to be successful all throughout their career. So leadership training and development, performance management, performance reviews, and employee engagement and listening to our employees and making sure that we respond to the needs that they have. 
And what I focus on is really working and overseeing some of our talent projects. So um, the way that we do performance reviews, we've really had a big push on redesigning that, making sure that we're setting clear expectations for our employees, that they have really good, defined, clear goals that they're working towards and how we can develop those employees. And along with that, we're ensuring that we have career paths and career opportunities here within the company and that we're giving those um, opportunities to our high potential employees who could one day be successful leaders here at ArcBest. It's a fun story. Evelyn and I actually both went to UCA and we were both in Alpha Sigma Tall. However, uh, we didn't know each other until we started working here at ArcBest. I might be a little bit older than Evelyn, not a lot, and uh, when we first started working in the same department, of course, we got to know each other and stumbled upon the fact that we were both UCA alum and Alpha Tau alum, and we were really excited. And I think that it's pretty cool that we have that common background of UCA and um, that you can not know each other, come into work, and then we share that UCA fair culture and get to work on the same team. So my mother actually remarried before I um, went to college. So I would come home to Fort Smith, but I never lived in Fort Smith. And when it was time to look for a job, I, one of my classes was transportation at UCA in business, the business school. And I had actually wrote a paper about ABF. So when I moved to Fort Smith, I just thought, okay, I don't know the area. And I just know this big company called ABF. And so I applied for ABF and I started in our our accounts receivables department and was there for about a year before I transferred into our talent management group which is where I've been the last five years. Uh, I work in the business insights and analytics department and my team specializes in predictive and prescriptive analytics. We build statistical and machine learning models that help business with their strategy and decision making. What I like about ArcBest is that even though this company is big and has been around for more than 95 years, uh, it still feels like a startup. We are given a lot of freedom and encouraged to innovate and also uh, the leadership are very easy to approach and uh, they also have high visibility to the projects and who does the projects that increases accountability and at the same time it's very satisfying when you can see the results of the work that you do. Some of the skills I need to use are problem solving capabilities and being adaptable, um, having good communication, and then also just knowing how to program because I'm a software developer. <laughs> And so, a great quote, uh, a guy named Oz Guinness wrote a book on this. He said, career calling is normally along the lines of your giftedness, but the purpose of So I'm a product owner at ArcBest, and my job is to manage an internal software um, that we use to quote freight. And so I manage uh, executive stakeholder um, expectations with um, tech resources and make sure that we're all pulling in the same direction and getting projects done. ArcBest is unique um, in that you have, it's a large corporation, so you have multiple different departments that you could go work in. You can work in accounting and finance, you can work in marketing and customer experience, you can work in operations, um, you can work in product management, you can work in technology. There's um, a multitude of options available at ArcFest. But within that, within that kind of large corporation feel, we have an amazing culture. Um, you have bosses who care about you. You have people who are invested in helping you grow. You know, one of the core values of our company is growth. And it's not just something that we put on the wall. It's it's a true investment in our people. And, and you're going to have people who are invested in making sure that you're the best you can be and that you grow in your career, that you're not just stuck in one place. Hi, Laura. We are driving back.
drive to Fort Smith right now. I'm not driving. Lauren's driving hi. Uh, from Conway. And uh, before we go, uh, we wanted to answer some questions that you guys submitted. Thank you for the questions. So uh, we're going to answer those right now. One of the questions we received was how does uh, logistics tie into the medical field? And the answer is it, it ties in a lot of ways. For example, ArcVest, we actually have several customers in the medical supply field and it's critical that we get these medical supplies to the hospital so that doctors and nurses can perform operations um, and also administer the right uh, prescriptions to their patients. Some of the surface level things that we look for when you come in to do an interview uh, with us are good eye contact, firm handshake, and a professional appearance. I think it's really important to make sure that you do your research on the company. And also, a lot of interviews nowadays are behavioral type interviews. So an interviewer will ask you questions on how did you handle a certain situation. So make sure you give them